Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, my name is Adini Selintari. And today I would like to explain the material about identifying the meaning of words in language acquisition for two until three years old children. Research method. In this study, the author used qualitative approach. The study was conducted in Dusun Dua Widorosari, Puchangan, Kartasura, Central Java. Data collection in the study was carried out by direct observation by observing the conversation and interaction between the child and their parents. Next slide. Two children were observed in the study. There are Fadil Hafiz Ardiansyah, two years and three months old, and Nagita Angelina Wahyu, two years and two months old. Next slide. Theory. Word learning is clearly much better if words are heard and practiced often by Dockrell, Brisby, and Best 2007, and Horse and Samuelson 2008. Next slide, please. The results of the study. The data was collected from conversations, interactions, and activities between children aged two years old with their parents. Here, the parents giving orders and the children as recipients of orders show a response in accordance with what was asked by the parents. Next slide. The data obtained from Fadil, he had two utterances by simplifying syllables by removing the first word and then producing the last syllable. Fadil has also tried to string two words into one sentence when he points or asks for a thing or object, even though it has not shown a clear meaning. In his age development, Fadil was able to interact or respond quickly when asked to show which pictures were banana, porridge, water, coast, and horse, and Fadil could immediately point to the right picture and express it with words. The spoken word is not complete because it removes the first letter of the syllable. Next slide, please. Fadil also produced spoken words by replacing the first letter of the actual words and add a letter at the end of a word. Meanwhile, he reducing one of the letters in the first, middle, and the end of the words. In addition, there are words that are pronounced differently from the actual words. There are some words that have been properly pronounced correctly. Fadil could accept, response, and attend to the words that he heard around him. But he cannot produce more than two words utterance because he focused on what is around him by eating snacks and watching YouTube videos. Next slide, please. The data obtained from Angel, she had two utterances by simplifying syllables by removing the first word and then producing the last syllable. Angel has also tried to string two words into one sentence when she points or asks for a thing or object, even though it has not shown a clear meaning. In her age development, Angel was able to interact or respond quickly. Meanwhile, the spoken word is not complete because it removes the first letter of the syllable. Next slide. Angel also produced spoken words by adding the last letter of the word. She also reducing one of the letters in the first, middle, and end of a word. There are some words which pronunciation is different from the original word. Angel also show a good response when she refused something such as snacks or refused when her parent gave instructions. There are some words that have been pronounced correctly. Angel could accept response and attend to the words that she heard around her, but she cannot produce more than two words utterance and still upside down in the pronunciation of words. Next slide, please. Conclusions. The words spoken by Fadil more than Angel when filled in the terms of age. Both of them are already able to respond to objects or things around them and express them in words such as when pointing at pictures, holding a broom, eating snacks, and playing. They can also interact when asking or refusing something. 
it can be concluded that on average, the words spoken by children of the age of Fadil and Angel, there are words that experience the addition of letters at the beginning and end of words, as well as the reduction of letters at the beginning and end of the word. There are also some words that Fadil and Angel can pronounce clearly and words whose pronunciation is far from the original word. At their age, Fadil and Angel also try to string two words into one sentence. Here are the documentation from Fadil and Angel. Next slide, please. Okay, I think that's all from me. Any questions? I want to add Adin. My name okay, is I... Aisha Vigariadi, and my question is, what are identifiable stages of a child's first language acquisition and how do children acquire the meaning of the words? Thank you. Okay, thank you, Aisha, for the questions. Is there any questions? Permission to ask Adin. Okay, Aniswi. Why do children age two until three years have word that add letters at the beginning and end of word and the Christ letter at the beginning and end of words? Thank you. Okay, thank you, Anisi, for the questions. Now I will try to answer the question from Aisha. Identifiable stage of a child's first language acquisitions divided into four stages. Firstly, the babbling stage occurring at around six months until about 12 months of age. During this stage, the child hears speech syllables from its environment and caregivers and attempts to imitate by uh, repeating them. Secondly, the holophrastic stage typically occurs around the age of 12 to 18 months. At this stage, children have identified which words and combinations of syllables are the most effective for communicating. Thirdly, the two-word stage occurs at around 18 months of age. At this stage, children are able to use two words in the right grammatical order. And lastly, the multi-word stage, children move on from two-word phrases and begin to form short sentences of around three, four, and five words, and eventually even more. Okay, I will try to answer the question from Anisvi. It is due to the initial consonant dilation when a child consistently leaves off consonants from the beginning of words, while young children often leave consonants off the ends of words. It is not common for children to delete beginning consonants. Okay, I think that's all. Anisvi and Aisha, is there any feedback? I think you enough, Adin. Thank you, Adin. Okay, thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone. Thank you for the chance that given to me. Let me introduce myself. My name is Yana Aurora Permata Gustia. Student number 20621010 class PPE 4A. In the opportunity, I would like to present about the analysis of syntax in first language acquisition in children to under three of Indonesia. Ground. Language acquisition is the applicable process in the brain of a child when acquiring language. There are two processes that occur when a child is paying them their first language competence and performance, but of this process are two different processes. Competence in is the master mastery of grammar. Mastery of grammar which takes place unconsciously. The process of the Competence be conditioned for, for the occurrence of the performance consists of two processes, namely the process of understanding and the publishing process or the process of making sentence. The process understanding involves the ability to observe or ability in thinking sentence here. Will publishing involves the ability of as young is so as you are publishing the sentence yourself. Next. The search method. Data collection in this study was carried out by direct observation by 
observing the conversation between the child and the child companion or parent, study in the analysis of syndrome in children acquisition. The subject is Nail Saba Susan Alvarisi, two years old, and Muhammad Ruzan Rupani, and three years old. Next. Content. In, syn in synthetic level, children start to speak when, with one word utterances. Utterance. One word utterance totally is a sentence for the children. Children do not randomly choose the word is one word utterances. They will choose the word that provides new information. At Jojo 2003. The author subject also went through the same track as other children in acquiring the first language. Nail and Rosen began to master the syntax of the of one word speech, two word speech, and three word speech, and multi word speech. All about three years old, Rosen is able to protest three words and more than three words. However, Nail only protests one, two, and three utterances. They can protest utterances in the form of sentence to be more complex and complete. Next. Example, the process acquiring syntax of subject. Next. Types of sentence products by the research subject. The classification of sentences based on the purpose of the communicative function sentence are classified into declarative sentence, imperative sentence, and interrogative sentence. Such are examples of declarative sentence, imperative sentence, and interrogative sentence. Next. Children is the process of language acquisition have different view about language for respect. Learned through the original grammar of his parent, sense human and born. Sense, then the family environment actively provide guidance and education. Guidance and education enable children to think about themselves and their sur surroundings, family and environment with different social status cause the education provided is also different so that the language mastered by children is also different. The more he interacts with the people around him, the better, the better his mastery of the language will be. This is because children must be able to use language in order to communicate with the people around them. Interaction and communication occurs when Nile gets a question and then he will answer. Rosen is able to use his language, he communicating with others, asking and answering questions. His parents also tell him to speak politely and clearly. They will ask him to repeat the correct as the correct speech in if he protests the wrong speech. This is important to have person protects good speech. Next. Conclusion. The process of getting the author subject syntax start with Nile and Ruzen can say a single word. The research subject were able to protest one word utterances at the age of zero until one year. Their vocabulary increased so much that they could protest two words, three words, and Ruzen could say many words. The research subject were able to speak Currently, even talk, they were three years old. They are able to talk like adults say using simple sentence. The writer got the information from this parent. In optioning the first language, research subject and influ influence by, by natural factor, input and social background. So it, it is very helpful for research subject is mastering the language. By receiving this input, he has able, able to acquire new words and increase his vocabulary so that now and Rosen called master in the first language. The next session is a question and answer session. Is there any question?
I want to ask the question. Yeah. Like okay, my question is from the research subjects to children with different age, namely two and three years. Is there a difference in word acquisition and speaking ability? If so, what are the differences? Thank you. Thank you, Cynthia. There any question? I want to ask the question. Okay, Ravida. From Neil and Ted's conversation, Neil, Dindin ayah mana? Ayah, mobil ayah lagi di bengkel sayang. Neil says the car is called Dindin. How did this happen? Why doesn't he call it a car or bill? Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thanks for the question. I will try to answer question from Cynthia. What is the difference between two and three years old in the acquisition of word and speech skill? So almost every day, a two years old child has a new vocabulary. He can make two word other uh, two word sentence like "Mama take a shower" and can follow two step two step commands by the act of to about 50% of his speech can be understood by, by others. At the age of three years, children can even string three or more, more words and start using interrogative sentences. They can name and use objects that are often encountered, notes, colors, and less to sing or, or remove. And I will try to answer a question from Rapida. When the mention of the car as dindin, because Nile had the sound of a car hanging is a dindin. This is because the development of children to your speaking is related to the ability to listen, understand, and arrange the words. Uh, the words heard. Maybe that's what I can explain. They are kind of as good back. I think enough, Rara. Thank you. Thank you, Rara, for the answer. Okay, because I have answered all the questions, I will present a presentation system. Thank you very much for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Introduce myself. My name is Anis V. Yunar Nabila. Number student 206120020. Here I will presentation about the meaning of word and sentence issue by children between the age of 2 until 3 years. Next. Research methods. Theoretical analysis is applied in this study by analyzing the meanings obtained by children in obtain. Their first language is in obtaining word in the child language. The data that has been analyzed in then presented descriptively which describe the language skill of children aged two until three years as is without refining the language use, two children were observed in this study. The first child, Muhammad Ruby al Bashinan, aged three years, two, Askia, aged three years. Next. Then the first child is Ruby. The first child named Ruby saw a photo of her mother with her parent. Then the first child named Ruby was clear in terms of pronunciation. Then it means that Ruby respond about the picture given that he saw her grandmother looking and he made a word that she know about the photo and show that his mother was looking and his show the expression in the in the photo was looking. Then the boy named Ruby 
respond to his wish to go to Sheva to his grandparents' house. Although he lives in Java because he has lived in Bandan for a long time, Ruby still follow the dialect and language there. Then from the word swing, he makes it like the strain of a song. Next. Next. The second child is Askia. The second child observed was difficult to interview if he was not accompanied by his family. His speech is difficult to manage by asking questions. She often refers to imitate speech from interview. Then in the next activity, his brother spoke and the child did not understand what she meant when the child word, namely she asked what was not saying she asked. CX, then C show from the word clam niele because his coat were torn. When the child feel the test of the food given is actually confused in terms of the name of the taste, which was originally lucky, which means sweet, but the meaning of the child intention is spicy and then it strengths or eliminates the taste of the tongue, which is spicy. Next. Kia show her expression that is feeling spicy and shy, which means spicy, but she kept curious about the Test of the food and see it, it again by opening his mouth and saying, Ah, uh, the letter this child named Kia so that his father or what his grandfather is referring to is working and I'm to profit fertilizer for him. On the first word, the child managed to pronounce the diaper correctly and then repeat. The word C said there was an error in the word being popos. When asked to sing, the child sang according to the direction. Pepe Atuskali, Ayatumbes Roti, Mamat Rati Parini. After the child says ora, means no, but no after that the child is told to sing following the direction. So, Chica Chica Jijinjing. In singing, this time the child did not sing completely because the child mood was changing. Next. Then the child says two choice, namely Bobo or Yos, which is mean by Mios. Kia chooses to Bobo, then broadcasts that there is food in the world and kupu because children are equal in their school at Paut. So those who understand the English word, namely no 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 no. The meaning convey is refusing to give ye ye nangi. In this word, the children express happy expression and the next word is to refuse him to say the word no. Then she looks from the expression. And the next word, kiyo, the meaning of the child is to show his foot. Then the child asks the presence of his grandmother as the word, bantindi. In this word, the child can pronounce uti clearly. Then the child asks about banti kwindi. I e, file my word mean. His grandmother belongs to him. Next. Conclusion. Conclusion. Conclusion, understanding sentence in children often differ from those that are clearly pronounced and have words that have different meaning in children pronunciation. 
When speaking, children are something clear and precise, but there are also error and repetition of word or sentence or sentence. The word observe, chair, there was repetition of the word tau, and in the first observe, children named Ruby, it was easy to express the picture in question for a child named Kia, if not with his family, then she doesn't want to talk, but she is an active child, but show an indication discomfort, namely by his active but silent behavior. The two children observe have clear pronunciation, but sometimes it is not clear and the sound is off. Then in the second child who was study, come sometimes wrongly expression detested, the salt be spicy becomes sweet and word purpose if repeated sometimes become that word purpose. Children act two until three years for word are difficult to regulate because it is based on the individual and the child mood. Next. Okay. Next question, Jason, if anyone want to ask. I want to ask Anisfi. Yes, please ask him. What is the significant difference between the two children observed when they producing words? Thank you. Thank you, Adin. Okay, any other question? I want to ask Anisfi. Yes, please, Aisha. My question is, what are some behavior associated with acquiring a second language and how does self-behaviors affect language acquisition? Thank you. Okay, thank you, Aisha. Okay, I think enough. I will answer a question. Mm, first question is, Ajinisi Lintang Sari. What is the significant difference between the two children observed by the producing word? Question. Answer is the difference is that the first child named Ruby is a person who is known to be interfering so that it is easy for him to interact with his word and it easy to provide information because of the interviewing, interviewing is his own family. And the second child is actually active, but in producing word, this family must be stimulated by word. As yet, then not to say unless his family asks. So Askia becomes a child who tends to refuse to give information. How oh, is Ajin can be is be understood and expect or is there any feedback? I think you know Aniski. Thank you for the answer. And I will answer a question. Second is Aisha Vika Ariati. What are some behavior associated with acquiring a second language and how does self behavior affect language acquisition? Answer is, so some common behavior among children who are beginning to acquire another language that may be mistaken for challenge, challenging behavior include no speaking typically, following direction, typically expression ideas and feeling and difficult responding to question consciously. The factor that influence language 
acquisition in children are the age factor because when you are a child, it will be easier to acquire a second language. The first language factor, mother, because the first language is very influential on other grammar. And how is Asia? Can it be understood and expect? Or is there any feedback? I think enough, Anis. Thank you. Thank you, Ais. And I think enough. Thank you. And so many present for me. If there is a world word, please forgive. And Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Aisha Fika Ariyadi and my student number is 2061-21033. I would like to say thank you for coming to my presentation. Okay, in this presentation, we will discuss about the analysis of syntax in first language acquisition in children to three years old in a nation. Methodology. The study is a qualitative descriptive approach and the object of this research is the utterance of three years old of different cultural backgrounds and will be studied through syntax. The language used by the child is a mixed language between Indonesian and Javanese, but Javanese dialects. The language is his first language or his native language. Next slide. Finding the linguistic aspect in this study analyzed were syntax of children's language acquisition. The sources of data were utterances that had taken from a two, three years old Indonesian child as the writer subject. The subject conversation with their family in Bahasa Indonesia were observed and voice record. Next. The first subject was a two-year-old Arjuna. Next. And the second was three years old Adam. Next slide. One, the process of acquiring the syntax. Next. The process of acquiring the syntax. Troix said that first language acquisition is a language with, which is acquired during early childhood and it normally begins before the age of about three years old. Bright said that before producing single word utterances, children are producing sounds of utterances that are meaningless to the adult. Then, the sounds develop into a language which is perfectly with the development of their age. In synthetic level, children will acquire the language from birth and children start to speak with one word utterances. Arjuna and Agam started acquiring the syntactic from one word utterance to word utterance to three word utterance and multi word utterance. So the conclusion is the cognitive development increased rapidly. Okay, for example, we can see in the following table, there are one word utterance, two word utterance, three word utterance, and multi word utterance. Note, when they add around zero one year, when they publish, they produce one word utterances, at the moment, they just could utter the last sounds of the word that they uttered. Next slide. Arjuna and Agam could acquire the language because there is first language alone, say and show from the development of his language. Arjuna learned new words and then him utter it. Agam could communicate well to other people around him. Arjuna was able to produce the sentences covering the questions, his feeling, ideas, expression, 
giving response to the people that communicated with him and answering the questions addressed to him. The development of synthesis of the research subject increased rapidly from one word utterance to word utterance, three word utterance, and sometimes Arjuna could produce more than three word utterance. Agam could accept, remember, and attend to the words or the language sound that he heard around him. So the role of their parents needs to continue to train in produce syntax so that they are always active in asking, answering, and sharing what they feel. Next. Types of sentences produced. Children will acquire the language from birth. They will pass some stages till they master the language. It starts from queen stage, battling stage, holoprostic stage, telegraphic stage, and multi-word stage. In synthetic level, children are start, start to speak with one word utterances. One word utterance is a very simple sentence. In the case of the research subject, the research subject also passed the same stages like other children in acquiring the first language. He started acquiring in the synthetic from one word utterance to word utterance to three words utterance and then multi word utterance. Next example, we can see in the following table, there are declarative, imperative, and interrogative sentences. Next. Chair states that many experts consider that syntactic acquisition start when a child can combine two or more words. Frumpkin et al. states that holoplastic speech is the one where utterances produced by the children to convey a more complex sentence. When children are still in the holoplastic stage, adults listen to the one word utterances often feel that the child is trying to convey a message. The classification of sentences based on the purpose of the communicative function, sentences are classified into declarative sentence, imperative sentence, and interrogative sentence. Next. Conclusion. From the result of this research, the researchers can conclude that child language acquisition is strongly influenced by psychological functions. Articulation function due to the incomplete articulation of a child aged two, three years so that the words spoken were not perfect. In acquiring the first language, the research subject was affected by a natural factor, input, input and social background. This natural factor was also influenced by the input and social interaction. Input helped the research subject so much in acquiring the language. The research subject got the input from the environment, for example, his parents, other family members, people around him, animal sounds, and electronic devices. The syntactic acquisition process of the research subject started when he could utter one word utterances. The writer realized that this research is limited and cannot describe in details about the first language acquisition process of a two year, three year old child in synthetic level. Parents, educators are expected to be active caring and synergizing in helping to develop children's abilities in the acquisition of language by providing as much as an as varied simulation as possible. Next. I think enough and there will be a question and answer session. Permission to ask Ice. Okay, Anis. How important is the study of first language acquisition theories in language teaching and learning? Thank you, Ais. Okay, Anis, thank you. Is there any question? I want to ask Ais. Okay, Adin, please. 
Are there any other factors that can affect it in acquiring the first language? Thank you. Okay, thank you, Adin. Okay, there are two questions. The first question from Adin Silindang Sari. Are there any other factors that can affect it in acquiring the first language? Thank you, Adin, for your question. And let me answer. Yes, there are. The factor include vocabulary, grammar, and inferences of mother tongue, so efficacy and motivation. These factors are vital to research for the process of acquiring second language. Language is composed of vocabulary words which are synchronized by grammar affected by first language. Is there any feedback? I think you know, Aisha. Thank you for the answer. Okay, the second question of Anastasia Nanabila. How important is the study of first language acquisition rights in language teaching and learning? Thank you, Anis, for your question and let me answer. It supports the ability of our child to communicate and express and understand feeling. It also supports our child's thinking ability and helps them develop and maintain relationships. Language development lays the foundation for the reading and writing skills in children as they enter and progress through school. Is there any feedback? I think enough, Ais. Thank you, Ais. Okay, anytime, Anis. I think enough for my presentation. Thank you so much for your attention and wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Ya, assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Let me introduce, my name is Cynthia Nur Fadri. Here I will present about my research Entitled Identify Children's First Language Acquisition at the Age of One Until Three Years Old. Okay, the research method and the subject. In this paper, the researchers used a qualitative approach. This research was conducted using documentation and interview data collection techniques, namely by observing the conversations between children and their parents. The first stage is listening and recording in the form of video recordings or sound recordings. The research was conducted, conducted when the children were playing activities accompanied by their parents. Then makes observations on the object. The subject of this study came from children age one to three years, totaling three children. They are the first is Muhammad Kolfati Hurusi or Fatir, age one years and three months. The second, Badar al Haizuran or Alpha, is two years old. And then Ayubi Baskar Pranata or Yubi is two years and five months. This language acquisition study focused on observing the acquisition of first words at the age of one until three years. Okay. The result observations were made at the same place and time. Observation, observation result so that children age two and two years and five months and five months have more words differences than children age one years, three months and two years. From the observation of the first subject, it is known that a two years and five months old child, namely Yubi, can pronounce 25 words correctly, but cannot pronounce the consonants R and L. He can say more than the vocabulary if there is a target object. Because the object displayed is only a maximum of 25 words and can pronounce everything correctly, even though he cannot pronounce the consonants R and L. In the second subject, uh, two years old, that is, that is alpha, can pronounce 18 words that are not pronounced clearly. 
is actually still able to imitate the pronunciation of new words, but he is still confused because he has never seen a new object or does, know, does not know what is it called and the new word has never been taught, so he does not know new vocabulary. And the third subject, Meanwhile, a child aged one year and three months, namely Fatir, can, al can already pronounce eight words with unclear pronunciation. Cannot say a, wo a word anymore because it is still difficult to pronounce and can only master the vowel A, I, and U. Okay, next is the conclusion. Language acquisition is a process that occurs in the child's brain when it acquires the first language or mother tongue, which is strongly influenced by the surrounding environment. Over time, children will acquire language other than those taught by their mothers, both seconds and third languages, and so on. However, it all depends on the social environment, the the child has in the learning process. So it, it can be concluded that the development of a child's vocabulary also depends on the vocabulary that the child receives from outside. This is what causes differences in word acquisition in each child. From the observation above, it can be concluded that age affects the number of children's vocabulary in this case, parents and the surrounding environment have a big role in acquiring the language that children will learn in formal institutions. Okay, because the presentation of the material has been completed, now it's time for the question and answer session. Um, if you have any question, please open your mic. Please. Okay, I have a question, India. Yes. Okay. Uh, the question is why does every child have a different familiarity uh, in the acquisition of every word? Thank you. Okay. Any other question? I want to ask the question. Yes. Based on the observations of a child named UP. He can pronounce the consonant R and L clearly. So how do you think he can start to pronounce the consonant clearly apart from the H factor? Thank you. Okay, thank you for the question, Rafida. And now I will answer the question from Fabrian. Every child has different reasoning in word acquisition because it is influenced by several factors. Namely, number one is age factor, because when you are a child, it will be easier to acquire language. And number two is the first language factor or mother tongue, because the first language is very influential on grammar other. And number three is environmental factors. The environment is a very important factor for the acquisition language in children because the child will acquire the language he often hears from environment, especially the environment of family, friends, and society. And the last factor is biological and cognitive factor. Okay, I think like that. But... Okay, thank you, Cynthia. Okay, thank you. And I will answer question from Rafida. It is normal for children not to be able to pronounce the letters R and L at the age of less than three years because basically children can pronounce these letters clearly when they are five to seven years old. But there are several ways that children can pronounce the letters faster, namely teaches how to place the tongue when pronounce the letter R and imitate the sound of object, and then sing, and brushing teeth. I think like that, please. Mm, okay, Cynthia, thank you. Okay, thank you. I think that's all for me. 
Thank you for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Oke, okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, I am Rafida Fitriana. My student number 20621201011. Next. In here, I will present the material about the analysis of words and the meaning of words in language acquisition for one years and six months to three years old. Let's see. Next. Methodology. On the face of it, learning the meaning of word seems like a simple task. In this study, I used a qualitative approach, Arbach and Silverstein, said the qualitative approach is a research activity that focuses on the analysis and interpretation of text and interviews to find meaningful descriptive patterns of a particular phenomenon. This qualitative approach aims to provide an overview of the facts of children's language in language acquisition in the world and the meaning words of the child as it is. The research was conducted in Koyolali City, precisely in Kemasan Village. The subject of this analysis are one, Nuril Ilham Afatan, one years and six months years old, two, Francis Gustafin Trinugraha is one years and nine months years old, three, Kinza Atarfa Mustahid is two years and ten months years old. Finding and results. First stage is to listen and record in the form of audio recording with a duration of three minutes. Observation carried out when children carry out playing activities accompanied by their companions. Then the second stage, the utterances are classified between target speech and children's speech. In the third stage, the utterance are translated. The fourth stage gives the meaning of the word and its category. For the meaning of the word means relating to the child's speech and the categories containing the word omission is carried out at the prefix of the syllable while from the middle syllable. Here, the child's family tries to stimulate the child to speak the words. Next. Tabel one, the child, namely Nuril Ilham Alfatan. Based on the data above, the child named Nuril Ilham Alfatan, he can speak a little bit, although it is not very clear and needs regular understanding. As an example above, the word mas should have been pronounced with ma. He changed the letter S to H. Next. Tabel 2, Francisco Stavin Trinugraha. Based on the title above, there is an omission prefix and alphabet as in the word "peli," which become "li." Next, tabel three, kita atarpa mustahil. Based on the title above, the pronunciation of words has started to be clear and complete, but some letters have been replaced so that the meaning of the word is different from what the child means. Next. Conclusion. The development of speech and vocabulary mastery in children is a challenge for parents to understand the meaning of the word. At the age of one year and six one years old, children still of an omission whether it's prefix suffix, middle syllable, or the addition of the alphabet at the age of two years and six months to three years old, the child has spoken in full words, 
but some letters are not clearly pronounced. They are those who replace the alphabet so that in understanding the meaning, it is sometimes misunderstood. The rule of pattern, the rule of parents, uh, the surrounding environment is very important, namely to continue to stimulate children so that vocabulary mastery continues to increase and with clearly pronunciation. Okay, for the next section is question and answer section. Uh, for anyone to have question, please open your microphone. I want to ask Kavita. Okay, Rara, come on. Why does parenting play an important role in children language development? Thank you. Thank you, Rara. Any other question? I want to go question. Okay, come okay, on. I want to question to Rafita. Uh, yes. Of the three subjects that you analyze, it is each child's acquisition the same as your uh, research results or difference? If different, why? What is the effect? Fuck you. Okay. I'll answer the question from Fabrian. So, uh, I think they are the same ones. They are different. The man investment is definitely from the family environment whether it's the mother and father of your grandparents etc and the difference is there's a kid that's been introduced to a cell phone and then it's opened to a video from youtube or something and there are children who have started playing with friends they say are uh, older than him so it is concluded that from all three subjects, language acquisition is the same and different. For his influence to be able to view a video or play with a more pro proscripted friend and perhaps if the word was not well enough for them to make the film. Okay, any feedback, Fabrian? Okay, I will answer the question from Shahni Aurora. Okay, I think we know the parents are the child's first teacher. Children of their age are often talked to on average if they grow up to be more communicative. And the odd is true. Parents play an important role in this regard. Parenting, educating, and speaking will continue to evict the child. Hence, upbringing plays a role in child language. And directly or indirectly, it stimulates children to native language. So, uh, any feedback, Shahni Aurora? I think enough, Rafida. Thank you. Okay, thank you. I think my presentation is enough. Thank you for attention. And I apologize if I make a mistake. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning. Uh, let me introduce myself. My name is Fabrian Dewey Pangestu. And in this time, I will explain or present about my analysis. The title is The Problem of the Production of Language Acquisition for Two and three years old. Okay, we go to the theory and 
language acquisition is the process by which human acquire the capacity to perceive, produce, and use words to communicate. And the ability to communicate is one of the most important human skills. With the ability to communicate, we can connect. Begin long before we learn to talk. In the first few months of life, babies show their interest in communicating by listening intently to the sound of the human voice, looking at people's face when they talk, and they engaging in back and forth babbling games with their parents. Okay, next. And uh, next is research methods. In research methods, I use a qualitative approach. Uh, a qualitative approach is a research activity that focuses on the analysis and interpretation of text and interviews to find meaningful descriptive patterns of a particular phenomenon. And this qualitative approach aims to provide an ob overview of the facts of children's language in language acquisition in the phonemic context of the child as it is. And the research was conducted in Sarakin City, previously in Sidrudati Village, Masaran District, and Cilacap, and Cilacap City in Pesanggeran Village, Kesukian District. And the source of data in this study was obtained of, from of, for observations of two children aged two and three years who live in the cities of Sarakin and Cilacap. And data collection in the study was carried out by indirect observation. Uh, namely by listening to the voice of children and their companions or parents or brothers via WhatsApp. And duration of via WhatsApp is four to five minutes. Okay, next Cynthia. And next is subject of the analysis. The first is Salwa Fahima from Sragen. The age is three to two years old. And the last is Asia Ayodhya Inara uh, the, from Cilacap City. The age is two years old. And the result is the researcher found 26 data in two meetings based on a four to five minutes via WhatsApp voice note. And data were collected from conversations between two to three years old with their families and the researcher of or myself. Here, the child family and the researchers act as the giver of others and the child as the reception of others. Okay, in the table one, uh, the data obtained from a child named Salwa Fahima is in data number one, two, five. And Aisha Ayuda Inara is in data number six, to 10. The first child named Salva Fahima has two utterance by simplifying the syllables by removing the first word and they producing in the last syllable in the words Ibu and Satu to become Buk and Atu. The second child named Aisha can produce three simplified syllables by removing in the first and last syllable syllables of the word, but also sometimes not both. It is found in the words ade and sweet to ade and anis. And in the table two, it can be concluded the children who are about two years old and three years old have almost the same abilities. The resulting speech between two year old uh, name is Aisha and three uh, years old, his name is Salwa. Uh, they can pronounce the word and more data was found on the correct pronunciation of words. Uh, the words can, that can be produced by Salwa and Aisha include Ia, Kake, Ena, Nanti, naik, 
and PP. And from the words, it can be seen that H can affect the acquisition of words in child's native language. Next, Cynthia. And all about of the presentation, it can be concluded that children's age around two years and three years have almost the same abilities. The resulting speech between three years and two months of Salwa, Fahima, and two years old by Aisha Ayutthaya Inara was the same. They can pronounce the word correctly, although there are still words that do not have the first of or last syllable. Then the two children also have something in common, namely data about the correct pronunciation of word. The words uh, that Salwa and Aisha can produce include chick, yes, grandfather, leather, good, and up. And from this word, it can be seen that age can affect the acquisition of word in the child's mother tongue. For the parents and other people, the researcher or myself suggested to enrich knowledge and information about phonological acquisition on the children, especially on two and three years old children, so that we can easy to understand the children when we are trying to communicate with them. For the other researcher and the readers, the researcher of myself suggested to continue the researchers to analyze it because we can find it easily in daily life. Next. Okay, I think that's all. Maybe any have question? I want to ask five. Okay, please, Shahne, Aurora. In your explanation, I can affect a child playing this. What if a child this act has a speech delay and how to deal with it. Thank you. Okay. Uh, anything have a, uh, anything have a question again? I want to ask my... Okay. Cynthia. It's concluded in the study that age can affect a child's word acquisition. Is a child's word acquisition only influenced by age or is there another influence? Thank you. Okay, thank you, Cynthia. Okay, I think it's the limited time. I want to answer the question from uh, Shahne Aurora. Uh, the question, uh, I want to answer to Shahne Aurora Permata question. The answer is causes for later speech, cause for late speech to children can be due to a set of factors such as raising an environment with more than one language or building well difficulty understanding words or searching words for hearing disorders of the oral structure such as harder speech disorder or a stuttering tongue and disorders in the in the I indifferent indifferent of those around the autism spectrum disorders, how to address its delay. Number one is have a simple discussion with the little one and engaging in small talk is one of the most effective why, uh, ways to cope with late talk. Number two is learn to sing together. And the last is reading a storybook or telling children stories. Any have feedback or Shahne Aurora Permata, sorry. Oh, thank you, Fab. Okay, thank you. And I want to answer the Shintia question. The answer is the result of the 
this study has been established the factors affecting the acquisition of language. Acquire a second language and the first language factor or mother tongue, since the first language greatly affects other grammar and upbringing can influence the development of language children. And this is because children's communication and interaction problems with parents have a unwittingly significant role in raising their child's uh, language skills and social status can also affect the development of the child's Indonesian vocabulary. And in this regard, the role of memory is essential uh, in the vocabulary master of the child. And the economic status of the pre-prosperous family can affect language development in children because socioeconomic plays a vital role in nutritional status and meeting needs uh, and affecting development processes. Okay, I think that's all. Any feedback, Cynthia? Okay, I think enough, Beth. Thank you for the answer. Okay, I think enough from this presentation. Thank you very much uh, for all. And wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.